Hello future doctors. Today I would like us to look at a clinical case in pediatrics together and try to solve the question together. We have a six month old boy who is brought to the healthcare provider for a well child examination. He was born at 39 weeks gestation via spontaneous vaginal delivery and the child is exclusively breastfed. He weighed 3,400 grams at birth. At the office, he appears well. His pulse is 126 per minute. Respiratory rate is 33 per minute and blood pressure is 78 over 44 millimeter mercury. He weighs 7.5 kilogram and measures 65 centimeter in length. The remainder of the physical examination is normal. So which of the following developmental milestones has this patient most likely met? So it's very important that you try to understand what they're asking you. So when we read the options, what we're looking for is which milestone should a six month old boy have already met. So the first option says that the patient bounces actively when held in standing position. So this is something that you would see in a child of around eight to nine months. And then the second option says that the child grabs small objects between thumb and finger. This in this case is describing an immature pincer grabs. Yes, because we have mature and immature pincer grabs. And this would be expected in a child of around seven to nine months. And the third option says the child intentionally rolls over to the back from the tummy. This we can expect in a six month old child. So if a six month old child is unable to roll over, we should be suspicious that maybe there is some um, developmental delay. But let's look at the other options as well. And option D says the patient picks up small object using a pincer grabs. Now this is a mature pincer grabs and you would see this in a child of around nine to 12 months. This milestone should be at least a year because it's a mature um, pincer grabs. The final one says, understand simple words like no or bye-bye. Now, comprehension of simple words should start around nine months and it becomes like very, very clear at around 12 months. And that brings us to our answer, option C. The child of six months should be able to intentionally roll over to the back from the tummy. Now, what are some things that we need to look for in a child of six months? A child of six months should be able to bounce when held in a seated position. A child of six months should be able to sit without support. And also they should be able to roll over both ways from the back, front to the back, from the back to the front. This is also very important. They should also be able to transfer objects to you as well. I hope you were able to learn a couple of things. Thank you and see you.